Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for April 26th of 2022, well, it is titled Planet Parade over Sydney Opera House. So what do we see here? Well, here in Australia, looking out over the Sydney Opera, ha Opera House, we see a line of planets up in the sky. Now, they may not stand out immediately as we look at this image. Which ones of these are stars and which ones are planets? And we see one brighter object, which we might guess is a planet, but the other ones seem to kind of fade in. And in all the planets, in some cases, are uh, similar to the brighter stars, depending on which planet you're looking at and the exact positioning in the sky. However, we can label these so we can see it a little bit better. And there we see down toward the Opera House is the planet Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system. And just up above that, the brightest object that we saw is Venus. Now, Venus is the brightest object in the sky other than our sun and moon. So that does tend to stand out and very in the very early morning we see Venus very prominently in the east right before uh, sunrise. Up above that we see Mars and then above that we see Saturn. And we note that they are in about a straight line and that is because the planets are in the same plane of the solar system in which the Earth orbits. So they will follow along the same path through the sky that the sun appears to follow because of Earth's orbit around the sun. And that is what we call the ecliptic. So here we can see the ecliptic kind of marked out by the positioning of these four planets. Now there's one more planet that was known to the ancient astronomers and that would be Mercury and that is not pictured here. But we will note over the coming months that the planets will change their positions and in fact in June Mercury will be visible as well. So there's a chance to see all five of these in the early morning sky. Now the planets again are changing positions so we will note Jupiter getting higher and higher in the sky. And in fact, in April, toward the end of April, it will they will class, class very close together, uh, Venus and Jupiter, and then trade places, Jupiter getting higher up above Venus. And then finally, as we get towards the end of May, it will pass over Mars as well. So they, they're constantly changing and that all just depends on the relative motions and their positioning in the sky so that we see them constantly changing uh, in this pattern. But this is a good chance to be able to see currently four planets and when we get to June, five planets in the early morning sky. So that was our picture of the day for April 26th of 2022. It was titled Planet Parade over Sydney Opera House. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Jupiter Eclipse. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.